I ask him what his accountability is in this family being off the rails. What's your accountability? I, have, I haven't done anything. I've always done my best with my kids. I've always taught them morals and values. I've always done everything with them. We're, we're all very close. I you, haven't done anything wrong. You wouldn't do anything differently. There, there's nothing you would change in your parenting. No. So you've been perfect. It's not about perfection at all. I just believe in doing the right thing at all times. Do you think you might have um, at times been a better role model? I've always been a good role model. I don't Do drink, I don't do drugs, I, I don't cheat. I'm basically always at home or with them. I'm, I'm, I haven't, well, do, I've been a very good role model. Do you think if, um, if you'd sit down with the girls and said, look, if, if he's not gonna be in the picture here, we need to rally around and become self-sufficient and do the things that we need to do to make our own way. And I'm gonna get a job and we're going to, we're gonna, we're gonna find a way to not let your dreams fall apart. We're gonna do everything we can and I'm gonna set the example by getting in the workforce and we're gonna have a division of labor among us here and, and we're gonna we're gonna become self-reliant, powerful women, and we're gonna do what we need to do to get ahead here. Do you think that might have been helpful? I don't know. I, I believe being a stay-at-home mom is what I've been meant to do. That's what I'm good at, that's all that I know. Well, it's, but, and, and that's, that's And a, I feel that she should have the same as she did. Well, and that's great if you can afford it, but I'm, I'm saying there comes time when things change that you have to be adaptive and roll with the changes. And you're an LPN, right? I've always been a stay-at-home mom. I went to school for that. But I are you an LPN? Across. Yes, but I'm not able to go into an and acute care setting and physically take care of someone. I don't... I. But you are a licensed practical nurse. Yes. And don't they require continuing education and you have to meet requirements every two years? Yes. And you've done that? Yes. Across these 23 years, you have taken the initiative to keep your LPN current on your continuing education, right? Yes. So as you sit here today, you are current and licensed to go into the workforce as a licensed practical nurse. Yes, but I, if I go into that position, mm -hmm. I'm not gonna be able to care for a patient because that was you know, 20 years ago. I would need to go back to school to retrain. Uh, which you, you could do, and probably you're gonna have to do, right? 